days of Eat Man Scandal Auto. And since 1998, I've been a very proud owner of MeatandPotatoes.com. And I'm here right now to do the Sunday, March 31st, 2019 NCAA College Basketball Against the Spread Pick'em Show. Just going to tackle one game on today's program, game 693-694. Got the Auburn Tigers. They're going to do battle with the Kentucky Wildcats. I'm going to give you my against the spread wagering selection in this matchup for about four or five minutes or so from now. But first off, you want to get the beat man's number one, my number one play for Sunday's basketball against the spread wagering action. It's $12, and it's guaranteed to cover the point spread. Or Monday's number one play is absolutely free. Text the word 1-O-N-E to 94253. Meat Man's got to give out the number one play for Sunday. I got to give it out for free to everybody that bought the number one play for Saturday. It lost. And I can tell you right now, Captain, number one play, it ain't lost in a couple of days. I got to get everybody off the list. The way I get them off the list, I got to win the number one play on Sunday. You know, I'm coming strong. I'm coming strong on Sunday, brother. It's $12 and you ought to get on board. Text the word 1-O-N-E to 94253. Now, what order to beat, man's Number one, basketball against the spread play for Sunday's wagering action. $12 guaranteed to cover the point spread off. Monday's number one play absolutely free over the phone. No problem, Cap. I got my own personal tone for number that I'm literally going to have to the day I die. It's one eight three three beat man That's how you talk directly with me. Las Vegas based professional handicap, but Dave Scandaliano. 1833 Meat Man. Get my number one play for Sunday's basketball against the spread wagering action. $12. Guaranteed to cover the point spread. Well, Monday's number one play is absolutely free. Text the word 1 O N E to 94253. Text the word 1 O N E to 942. Five, three. All right, a couple of things real fast. Make sure you subscribe to Dave Scandaliano's YouTube channel. That way you never miss any of the Meat Man's YouTube videos. My YouTube video for Saturday got about half the views it normally does because I didn't do it till Saturday morning. Normally I do the YouTube videos overnight. This one I did on Saturday morning. You didn't get a notification or something like that to let you know that the Meat Man just did a YouTube video, and you missed out on that winner that I gave out? Aye! Make sure you subscribe to Dave Scandaliano's YouTube channel. Now, if you do happen to miss any of the Meat Man's YouTube videos, you can now watch the replay on the homepage of my website, meatandpotatoes.com. That is the internet home of Dave the Meat Man Scandaliano, www.meat. A-N-D. P-O-T-A-T-O-E-S dot C-O-M meat and potatoes dot com. And finally, you want to get a free pay play for the meat man? Send straight to your text message box on your phone. Two, three, four, five, six, many, seven days a week. Absolutely free. Text the word meat man. Mind me. M-E-A-T-M-A-N to 94253. This is a complimentary service. I hope everybody watches my YouTube videos. But you have to opt in by texting the word Meat Man. My name is M-E-A-T-M-A-N to 94253. Now, after you text the word Meat Man, M-E-A-T-M-A-N to 94253, you're going to be automatically enrolled in the Meat Man's free premium picks text message service. Then within like 24 hours or so, you're going to get a phone call from a good friend of mine, my sales guy. His name is Rich. I've been on Richie for... 30 years. I used to wait tables with Rich in a French quarter when the beat man was 19 years old. Rich is going to call you to make sure that you're at least, at least 21 years old. He's going to confirm that you opt in on the beat man's free premium fixed tax pension list. And yes, he might try to sell you something. You don't want to buy nothing. No problem, Cap. To get on the beat man's free premium fixed tax pension list, it is absolutely free. And all the plays, all the texts, Come directly from me. Richie doesn't know how to use a text message to you. Like, hey, he doesn't know how to do it. He knows how to check the phone numbers, but he doesn't know how to send a text message out. 
I sent out all the plays, brother. You get the play directly from me. Las Vegas based professor, any kind of Dave Scan, I'll have him. Text the word Meat Man. Money. M-E-A-T. M E A T M A N. The 942-535. Sunday. March Madness, college basketball. It's going to be the Meat Man's eighth, eighth college basketball March Madness YouTube video on a 2019 season. We did four YouTube videos last week, went three and one. We've done three YouTube videos this week, and we're two and one. Not bad. Not bad, Barb, and two. Not bad for free, Cap. That's not bad, right? <laughs> Look, I don't give out leans in my videos. I don't give out this. I give out one play. One play, I talk about one game. That way I don't confuse everybody. Uh, was it a lean? Was it a pick? Was it this? Was it that? Ah, only do one. Only do one. Five and two. Five and two. That's not too bad. That's not too bad. Ah, how about that big? How about that big on Saturday, Cap? <laughs> the Virginia Cavaliers minus the points. Yeah, we needed every second of the game, every second of overtime. Look, I know I got lucky. I know the meat man got lucky. But bottom line, bottom line, luck plays a huge part. Plays a huge part in any kind of gambling, sports gambling, any kind of gambling. But, yes, got lucky. But, look, look at all the games that the meat man's lost getting unlucky. I mean, come on, man. Come on. Yeah, I got lucky. Yeah, I got lucky, but that's fine. That's fine. Five and two. Five and two. Yeah, I got lucky on one game. That's fine. Give the meat man the light. Give the meat man the light for Sunday's NCAA college basketball tournament YouTube video. You appreciate all the hard work that the meat man puts out doing those YouTube videos and giving you that five and two record through the Seven games in an NCAA basketball tournament. Five and two, Cap. Get the beat man to like. Let the beat man know. Let me see them like. The other day we had 110 likes. We had 110. I couldn't believe it. I couldn't believe it. I ain't going to lie to everybody. I ain't going to lie to everybody. I couldn't believe I had 110 likes. Because the beat man, I don't buy likes. I don't like the video myself or nothing like that. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. So, so I do appreciate that. I do appreciate that. Five, two, with the seven YouTube videos for the NCAA basketball tournament. The Meat Man of Light. See if we can't get to six and two. Let's see if we can't go 75%. Man, it's tough. It's tough. Now you got the Kentucky Wildcats. They're going to do battle with the Auburn Tigers. The line of this game at Chris Bookmaker, where the line originates, it opened four. At least I think it opened for. I don't know. I think it. I'm pretty sure it opened for. Ah, I forgot. I think it opened for, and it's still for. It's still for. The Kentucky Wildcats are a four-point favorite against the Auburn Tigers. Everywhere else on planet Earth, as I do this video, it's four and a half. I don't get it. I don't get it. I mean, everywhere, everywhere. I mean, the meat man right there. Ah, the clown joint, MGM, ah, they got four and a half. Station Casino, they got four and a half. William Hill, they got four and a half. Westgate's got four and a half. Everybody's got four and a half. And since I live in America, the good old U.S. of A. As much as I like Chris Bookmaker, where the line originates, I'm going to take my business elsewhere on Sunday. I'm going to take my business elsewhere to a place where I get the four and a half. I'm going to buy it half a point. I'm going to knock it up to five, and I'm going to take the Auburn Tigers plus five points minus a dollar twenty. Remember, when you buy the half a point, you got to lay 12 to win 10, 60 to win 50, 120 to win 100. Normally, you bet 11 to win 10, 55 to win 50, 110 to win 100. But I'm never going to lose a game by half a point ever again. So if I go somewhere where the point spreads on a half a point, I always buy the half a point, knock it up to flat number, and I lay the dollar twenty. Now, this is a double revenge game. This is a double revenge game for the Auburn Tigers. Now, I know there's a lot of newbies in the Beat Man's YouTube videos, and a lot of people say, well, Beat Man, oh, oh, what's a double revenge game? 
I'm going to explain it to you right now. A double revenge game is when you play the team two times and they beat you both times. Now they're going to play the third time. In the beginning of the season, the Kentucky Wildcats went on a road to play the Auburn Tigers. And the Kentucky Wildcats won that game 82 to 80. They won the game by two points. They won the game by two points. Now, later in the year, these two teams were going to meet again. They were going to meet again. Auburn was going to go on the road, and they're going to do battle with Kentucky. Auburn lost at home when they played Kentucky. So now the Tigers are motivated here, and they go to Kentucky, and Auburn loses the game 80 to 53. They lose by 27 points. They got skunk, Cap. I mean, you talking about skunk. They got whipped. They got whipped. Now, look, since that game, since that game, the Auburn Tigers have not lost. They have not lost. That was their wake-up call. They won 11 in a row. They won 11 in a row. They ripped. They absolutely ripped through the SEC basketball tournament. They went 4-0, and they won their games. They had four games by an average of 10 points. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Then they got to the NCAA tournament. They beat a good New Mexico State Aggies team who had won, what, like 15, 16 in a row? Then they beat the Kansas Jayhawks, and they annihilate, annihilate the North Carolina Tar Heels. They're hot, baby. They're hot. Now, look, there's an old saying. It's hard to beat a team three times in one year. And actually, that's not true. But it is hard to beat a team three times in one year, and the third time you got to beat them by six points. That is true. Look, I'm telling you right now, these are the kind of games that the Meat Man likes. These are these are revenge games. These are these revenge games. These are the re- revenge games. Meat Man loves revenge games. I love revenge games. And when you lose by 27 points, you're in a revenge spot if you get to play them somewhere down the road. Now look. The last 11 games, like I said, for the Auburn Tigers, they're 11-0. Kentucky's last 10 games, they're 8-2. That's not bad. Both losses were to the Tennessee Volunteers. Kentucky played Tennessee three times this year. They beat them at home, lost to them on the road, and then they lost to them on a neutral site. So what I'm getting at is when Auburn played Tennessee, the Tigers beat the Volunteers, okay? So, so the last two times Kentucky played Tennessee, Tennessee beat Kentucky. The last time Auburn played Tennessee, the Tigers beat the Volunteers. I just like that. I like that. I like that, especially when you're catching five points, okay? Yeah, yeah, it might not be a good argument if you're laying five, but we're catching five, okay? There's a big difference between laying five and catching five. Now, look. Look, the bottom line, bottom line, I like this pick, man. I like this pick. I know the Kentucky Wildcats are a dangerous team. I know it's Kentucky. I know it's the Wildcats. But, man, I'm telling you, they did their Houdini act. They did their Houdini act on, on Friday after blowing a big lead to the Houston Cougars. I can't believe not only the Kentucky Wildcats win the game but cover the spread. <laughs> you talking about luck. You're talking about luck, man. A lot of these games are decided by luck. When it comes to the point spread, I like Auburn here. I like the Tigers. They're getting four and a half, five and a half a point, knocking it up to five. I'm going to lay a dollar 20. Put the meat man down on Sunday. I'm going to take the Auburn Tigers plus the points. All right, now. Want to get the meat man's number one play? My number one play, I'm going to try like heck to make it the second game of the NCA March Madness action. But if I can't, it'll come from the NBA. My number one play. You know I'm coming strong, Cap, because I lost the number one play on Saturday. So you know I'm coming strong on Sunday, brother. That's how it works. That's how it works. Meet me and lose the game. Get the next day free. way I get everybody that's purchased the number one play on Saturday, the way I get them off the list, I win on Sunday. Simple as that, Cap. Simple as that. Don't miss out on the Meat Man's big play for Sunday's basketball against the spread wagering action. Don't let the price fool you. $12 for my number one play 
for Sunday's basketball against the spread wagering action, text the word one, O-N-E, to nine four two five three. Get the beat man's number one basketball play for Sunday's against the spread wagering action. Twelve dollars. Text the word one, O-N-E, to nine four two five three. Order the beat man's number one basketball play for Sunday's against the spread wagering action. Twelve dollars right over the phone directly from me. Las Vegas based for best handicapper Dave Scandaliano. When you call toll free one eight three three. Meet man!